In a moment when someone asks me a question, whether it's for my feedback, for my opinion, for my thoughts or for my feelings, sometimes I've got so many things going on, I'm not sure how to say it. And it kind of comes out like blah. Now what that means is it's not that you're a slow thinker. It's because you don't have frameworks that you can rely on. Because the human brain is so complex, right? If I asked you, how do you feel about pineapples, right? The brain kind of goes, well, I don't know. What do you want me to talk about pineapples? I mean, do I talk about the way they taste? Do I talk about my, my like for it? Do I talk about whether it's generally accepted or not? If most people like it, do I talk about whether it's available in Portugal? And then your brain just goes crazy. So that happens to all of us. And the people who can answer very quickly, they have mental models and frameworks that they use. This one is called prep. And in my brain now, I've got locked 10 to 15 frameworks. And anytime people ask me questions, in my brain, because I'm so familiar with these frameworks, I just move straight to the framework that I need. My thoughts, crazy thoughts, get distilled into this framework, and then I'm able to share with you a meaningful piece of communication. Now, PREP is an acronym. What it stands for is, first of all, POINT. So you, first, I'll give you an example in a moment. You share a point, then you share a reason for you sharing that point. After you've shared the reason, you also need to give an example. And then you reiterate the point. This is a good one for feedback. Let's say the point I'm trying to make is this. The point I'm trying to make is I'm saying to my team members and I'm at work and I'm saying, we should use more automation technology at work, in our workflow. That's my point, okay? And then I can say to them something like, I waste so much time every single week doing emails back and forth, trying to set up a time to have a meeting with someone. Give them a full example, right? I've used a software called Calendly, and now instead of sending six to eight emails back and forth to set up one meeting time, and doing this 10 times with 10 different clients, I now send one email. I really feel that we should investigate more automations and how we can use automations in different areas of our business to be able to increase efficiency. I could deliver that in less than a minute, it's a very meaningful piece of conversation that has a really clear outcome that you're, you're after. Otherwise, in corporate meetings, this happens all the time. People just waffle because they have no frameworks. So you hear this all the time. Hey everyone, listen, we need to get more aligned. We need to get our ducks in a row because if our ducks are not in a row, we become less efficient. And I wanna make sure we create lots of alignment here and synergies. That synergy is critical for us as we move forward. To, and really, they're saying nothing. I never want you to say things like, I'm a slow thinker. Uh, I, I can't do this. It's simply because we don't have the right tools, that's all. You've been trying to drill a hole with a screwdriver and then you've been blaming yourself, but rather it's just the tools you have access to. So all you now need to do is learn, learn the frameworks and now you've got tools for the right situation. And the more tools you have, the more effective you can become in any situation.